Welcome back, Seth Bling here. About 11 years ago, I made tetherball in Minecraft using a pig and a lead. I thought I could do a little bit better with my physics engine data pack, so I made tetherball and spiced it up a little bit. I made a few different variants and invited some of my friends to play it with me. Enjoy. All right, well, hello, Etho. Hey, man, how's it going? <laughs> it's good, it's been a while. It's uh, a very long time. Thanks for joining me for Tether Block. So, hello, Misty. Hello. Yes. You ready to see Tether Block? Oh, I sure am. Okay, so this is my Minecraft Tether Ball using my physics data pack. Uh, it's pretty straightforward. You just punch the thing and it moves around. Boink. Uh, so you can hit the ball <laughs> and the ball bounces around. Uh, the cord wraps around the pole and everything. Um, so... No way. <laughs> yeah, way. Uh, okay, and... I expected the block to move. I didn't expect the cord to wrap around. That's, yeah, that's the cord wraps nuts. around. Boink. The cord here does wrap around oh. the pole. Oh, I didn't um, see that on Twitter. Oh, this looks very good. <laughs> yes. Oh, you should see at the top a uh, a bar that shows the progress, right? Oh, okay. So, so it kind of tracks it. Yeah. So as it wraps around, there you go. You can start to see it moving. Um, yeah. So once the bar you know fills up or empties completely, that's that's the winner. So uh, so I have a few different variants to show you. We'll start off with just normal normal tether ball. Um, let's see. So we have to pick directions, right? Oh, do we? I have no yeah. idea how to. I didn't know there <laughs> You've was never like played tether ball. Okay. No. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go clockwise. Which, if I look down and draw a clock on the ground, it goes okay. the direction the clock goes. You go counterclockwise. So if I just punched it right now, it'd be going clockwise. Why don't you okay. give it the first hit? I'll I'll be sporting. Okay. Why don't you give it the first hit? All right. So I am going counter. Yep. So there we go. And cool. Wait, uh, what are I, are you allowed to like go to the other person's side, or you have to stay? Yeah, like, yeah, you can half? you can go wherever you want. You can There's go like no, anywhere. We're both in creative mode. You can fly around if you want. Oh, okay. Yeah. I can actually reach for the first time ever in tetherball. <laughs> no, stop going this way. You're gonna win. Uh, yeah, oh, that, shoot. But, uh, I'll let you get the first hit. I'm very sporting like that. Cool. Okay, there you go. So you can. Oh, you're in creative mode too. So you can you can fly around if you want. But I'm not sure it's gonna <laughs> okay. help that much. It does uh -oh. help. Uh -oh. It does help that uh, this is on my computer. This is gonna be. This is gonna be a quick game. All right. No, I got. I got there. it. Uh, uh, there's still a couple of pixels. I think I got it though. All no. right. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. It would. It really would have helped my elementary school tetherball career if I could fly though. If only. <laughs> yeah. Thank. You. Oh, here we go. Would have been nice. So how do you how do you program the the like rope to actually work and wrap around <laughs> the fence? Yeah, I mean, uh, so the rope is is kind of it's actually just a block display entity, just like the the physics the cube is the the tether block is. Um, it's just stretched out to be real real long and real thin, and uh, every time that the root the rope like, it, so it's a straight line, and if the rope would ever intersect with the with the pole then it basically splits the rope into two ropes and leaves one rope sort of attached to the pole and then the or um, kind of wrapping around the pole and the other one's free to follow the block you want to try the next variant yeah sure i don't even know how you, you make variants of oh <laughs> so thicker poles this, this is called fat as you fat can see at the top of the screen block. let's see i'm going <laughs> clockwise so i don't even want to i got to come over here if i want it yeah so yeah we can start playing <laughs> okay um, I'm gonna try to stay on the ground. I'm gonna okay. keep it real. All right. Now the oh, the cube. Oh, oh, oh. I think you just won. <laughs> Wait, what? The, the cube does not render or does not uh, wrap as many times around the pole when it's fat like this. Oh, right? okay. <laughs> so pretty much so one time around. The bar just fills real is, quick. Yeah, pretty much one time around is enough. Oh. I'm trying to click on it. I can't tell like my distance. Yeah, the the hit the the distance is ten blocks. Ah. Sorry, I'm not well versed in. I win. <laughs> I'm so good at this. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, oh, you got. I might be enough. <laughs> you got a good, good momentum going there. Oh, I didn't quite get there. Oh, oh I missed. I think it. I got it. I think I got it. Yeah. <laughs> wow. All right, all right. I, I'm just gonna load up the next variant. You ready? Okay. All right. Here's the next variant. It's called Obese. Go. <laughs> oh my god. Go. I guess I'm hitting it the, the wrong direction. <laughs> okay. You win. Four. This one, I don't, poor Paul, what have you done? Yeah, I don't think this one even, like, it's hard to get it to even wrap all the way around one time. There you go. 
I don't think it can go around the yeah. and it, oh, I guess it stretches if you really yeah, it does stretch whack actually. it or something. Yeah. Pull in just because the pole is so fat that you can't even get it. Oh, does there you go, sense? you did it. I saw it. You win. Easy okay. W. All Easy, right. Not even close. All right, this one's called obese. <laughs> <laughs> does the cord get longer with these, or is it just? No, it's the same. It's the same length. You want to? Oh my goodness. The, cord, the ball's over here on the other side. You probably can't see it from over there. Right, you got the, I'm starting this one again because I'm not here. doing too well. Yeah, go for it. All right. <laughs> oh, you've almost won. You got to help it around. Yeah. Oh, I oh, win. <laughs> what in the world? It went on top. Uh, you ready for the next game mode? Of course. Okay, here we go. Uh, this one's all you. You got this. <laughs> Is this like a mini game? You're trying to like get it up there? Or... Yeah, yeah. So, so you can kind of see it's like a cup. I'm standing inside of it. <laughs> okay. Got it. Yeah, this one's all you. Go for it. Go. <laughs> okay. Crit hit. Oh, I thought that was going to go in. I thought that, that was going to be sick first, first try. Oh, my God. What? It does you... still wrap around the pole. The rope doesn't like wrap around the cup, though. It just the rope just. Oh, it just goes through it. But the yeah. block goes in. OK, right, yeah, yeah. what if I just go like so if I hit it straight up from the bottom, will it? Oh, never mind. Got <laughs> it. Right, there I guess, you go. I guess he's told it. Good job. Nice. That was actually that was really quick. Much, Let's much go. faster than it took me the first time. I believe. Oh. Oh, that looked like it was going to go in. And then again on the rebound. Oh. Oh! oh! Easy. <laughs> wow. That was Easy. pretty quick, actually. I'm. They just call me the, te the tether baller. They call me Do they? They, they call, yeah. Even though you've never played tether ball before, they call yeah. you the tether baller. Oh, when I went to school, they would say, oh, look, the tether baller. And then they would beat me up and take my money. But that, that's <laughs> irrelevant. They still called it the, to me. The, yeah, the tether ball. That's the important point yeah. of the story. What in the world? <laughs> it's just you. Go for it. You're trying to get the. Oh. <laughs> see, it's like a, it's like a cup. Oh, oh you got to get it on top into yeah, the cup. You're trying I to get. See. Oh my god! Did you get there it on your go. second hit? I did. Yeah. Everyone, everyone who has tried this is much better at this than me. It took me so many tries. <laughs> Good job! Wow. All right, ready for the next one? Let's see it. Okay, here we go. It's multi ball. Oh <laughs> go, go. snap! Okay. Go go go! <laughs> So uh, the uh, the score at the top is the average of the three of the three. So you kind of have to get all three all the way around in order to win on this one. I like oh. the noise. <laughs> Thanks. It is actually it's the the sound of fall damage, but turned down by an octave. Don't call it a comeback. Oh. Oh, what? <laughs> did you I don't see know that? what's happening. I did. Yeah. It's, it did register a win for me very briefly. Definitely not a glitch. Very in intentional behavior. Mm -hmm. Of course, of course. The ropes don't uh don't like tangle with each other, but they will still go around the pole. Oh. I, I have had more practice, and also it's running on my local machine, so I do have a bit of a. a oh yeah, advantage. that's that's actually why so everybody can... watching this. The only reason why I'm I'm not winning is because of uh ping. Yeah, just blame it blame oh. it on the lag. You're good. Yeah, I really am just having flashbacks of a particularly tall person at <laughs> elementary school who, really? on a few occasions, was like. Yeah, Yo, you want to play tetherball? And he could just, uh, his reach was probably like a foot and a half higher than mine. And he would just basically be dunking on me repeatedly. And I couldn't even touch the ball. It sounds like you have some <laughs> unresolved uh, tetherball trauma <laughs> that you might need to deal with. I don't think I ever won a tetherball, I'm going to be honest with you, dude. Do you spam your, your click as you're Oh, yeah. You oh, yeah. Oh, that's the mistake <laughs> I'm making. Then. You're trying to build up your power attack? I, you got to be able to like do a slam attack, you know. It's like wrapped around above the pole. <laughs> totally, totally normal behavior for a yeah. This is this is my trick: is I is I trick you into playing games with me where <laughs> where ping is really important, and then your Canadian ping. <laughs> it doesn't my, help me out at all. My local machine. Are the ropes the same length for each of them, though. Uh, yeah, yeah, the ropes the same length. I'm about to win here already. I got it. <laughs> Ethan, uh, I'm crushing you. What's going on you here? You've had practice. I haven't. I feel like yeah. tetherball is like a, it's, oh, you got me. It's like a precursor for being a basketball player. <laughs> Don't try this in real life. You'll get everything all knotted up. Uh, all right. You ready for the next game? Oh, my God. You have so many variations. There's two two more. There's two more. Okay. Ready? Okay. Here we go. <laughs> you can fly. It's okay to fly. Okay. Swimming tether, uh, polo tether ball. So the, I don't think it's going to wrap, is it? It does wrap. Oh, no, look, it's wrapping. It's just very slowly. 
Uh, and the, and the, the, of course, the ball has buoyancy, one of the one of the features of my very of cool data pack. Piece yeah, pack. in my video, when they would like glitch out of the floor and just float in the water, everyone was always like, ooh, it floats. <laughs> oh, it kind of it has high friction in the water, too. Huh? Yeah, yeah. Oh, you, you like... <laughs> I hit it under, under you. The, under the water. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> usually in usually in Tetherball, you got to try and hit over your opponent, but in this case, <laughs> you go under. I think you're about to beat Come me, on. which is upsetting. No. But no. But I'm happy for you at the same time. No. All right. You win. I did it. I did it. Your infinitely long loser streak. It's over. I did it. All I've right. overcome my childhood trauma. Get, get He's on a break away. <laughs> No! Get it going! Get it going! No! No! Stop. We gotta win one of these! Stop! <laughs> it's like go, really go. stretching as it wraps around. I think... Alright. Oh! Oh, okay. You didn't quite have it. There were pixels. Uh, I saw the pixels! Oh, no. uh, oh come on! Come on! Come on! It hit! It hit. <laughs> Alright, you got there it. There we go. I, you I won one, was... Etho! <laughs> Congrats That's a win! Whew. Oh, all the grass is That's dying. Gracious. You see that? I ah, do. distracted you. Oh, no. Oh, what? You win! Yep. I'm distracted you. <laughs> totally normal tetherball stuff here. All right, next game mode. You ready? All right, this one is called Gravity, Gravity Gun. Gun. And hitting the hitting the ball doesn't do anything. Can you figure uh -huh. out what you're supposed to do? No, not yet. And with this one, you can't hit the ball. If you try and hit the ball, it doesn't do anything. Okay. Instead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got to throw stuff at it, huh? Yeah. Oh, that's wild. <laughs> I'm like trying to figure out where I where I tractor beam the thing. What? Uh, <laughs> what? Uh, oh. Yeah, oh. So this is gravity gun tether ball. I'm going to spleef you. <laughs> that's actually not a bad idea. Trap someone in the hole. I have not played much Gmod or Half-Life. So <laughs> I know what it is. But I don't know how to use it. Ah! You just sort of pick up things and then shoot them. This feels really cool. <laughs> this, this is my favorite one by a long shot. <laughs> yeah, this is uh, this is sort of the the, the point of the the whole thing. You're winning. Like you say, you don't know how to do it, but yeah, come on. Oh my god. Oh, now he's oh, getting the hang of it. You're crushing oh, me. Now no, he's getting the hang of it. Stop. No. Come on. Wait, did no. that count? Was that was that, that it? That is, that that's DG? it. You win. Yeah, the real trick to this one is uh, you can just fly around with a cube. <laughs> okay, I was trying to do the uh. The, the shoot it at the thing. Yeah, yeah. But that works too. You wanna know you wanna know the real trick to this? Oh yeah. you figured it out. <laughs> <laughs> you can also like it does uh if you just like you can kind of swing you can kind of swing the cube. And it, it does oh, actually so it like keeps the momentum more, that makes gets sense. more momentum that way, yeah. So is the is the collision box actually like exactly the, the boundary of the cube or does it adopt like a spherical no, it's Shit. it's actually the the boundary of the cube, and and they they'll bounce off each other like cubes would would bounce off each other. It's definitely not spherical. The the only thing that's kind of fudged here is that the the pole uh, actually has a, a collision box that's a little bit bigger. It's a one block wide. It's a full block collision box. I gotta stop it before it wraps. Oh, it's going so slow. <laughs> oh, I win. Oh, we got we got, I win. We got a bunch. What is this? What uh, is okay. This? What is this? What? Uh, well, I th technically says that I win. It says clockwise wins. So, uh huh. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, victory! All right, and that is all the game modes I have. <laughs> well, thank you, Seth. That was super cool. Well, anyway, that's that's all I that's all I have for <laughs> Tether Block. So, okay. Thanks, thanks for coming by. And that's uh, all he yeah. says. Oh, what the. <laughs> Wait a minute. I broke it. <laughs> you did break it. Okay, oh, that's well. That's a great way to wrap it. <laughs> thanks for watching. <laughs> oh, thanks for having me.